Welcome back to the Little Reef. Today we're doing a how-to video on Polyp Labs Reef Roids. So I was excited to open it, wanted to make sure it was the right thing and not look like a donut on my video. So there we go. Polyp Labs Reef Roids. Never used it before, but I've read lots of good reviews. Um, Meant to be really good for helping corals grow and open. Does say on it, um, unique blend formula ideal for gonoporia and zoanthids. Um, is good for mushrooms, and I've read lots of people say that it, to be fair, it's good for pretty much all corals. But primary usage we have it for is for gonies and go. Oh, sorry, gonies and zoas. So what we're gonna do. So we're going to get this open. Um, dosage, it says it's half a teaspoon for 50 gallon tank. Now, I've got a 125 litre tank, which I think is around 40 gallons, 45 roughly. So, we're still going to go um, sort of roughly half a teaspoon, but I've not got a massive amount of corals either. So, it will be a learning curve, probably be too much, but we shall see. Um, but here we go. What I've got. These are my reefroids. I've got my 5ml syringe and I've took roughly 10ml of water out of my tank, which I've just popped in there. So we're going to mix the reefroids into the water. Um, I want to try and target feed rather than broadcast feed the whole tank. So um, I'm going to mix it into the water, see if that's enough. I might need more water again learning, so we're not sure, but we will find out as we go along. I'm going to mix it in there, suck it back up into my syringe once we've got a bit more of a sort of a solution of it um, and then we'll go over to the tank and we'll attempt some target feeding. First impressions, Reefroids absolutely stinks. There it is. So, we've got our spoon. We're going to go half a mound maybe. Give it a go. So we'll pop that in there. We've got our syringe, we'll give it a mix. Oops. Quite liquidy, I'm not sure if that's good or not. Maybe I've put a bit too much water, not enough reefroids. We will see as we go along. I have a feeling we will need it a little bit thicker than this to be able to uh actually target the corals but we'll give it a go like so full syringe and there's a little bit left over let's go to the tank and we'll give it a go okay so we've turned our power heads and our filter off make sure we have no flow in the tank so we can try and feed directly to where we're going so The gonies are noticeably closing up really fast. That's not necessarily from them eating, that may just be a bit of a stress reaction. Um, they're still kind of settling in at the moment, they're not entirely used to the tank. Um, seem to still find any excuse to close up at the moment. I was told by my local fish store that gonies are easy to keep um, and as an inexperienced reefer I rapidly discovered that apparently they're not. But we're going to give them a go and we hope that reef roids is one of our best options so we'll give them a feed. Absolutely doused them in food. But the little reef is new, we are learning. Come along for the journey with us and learn with us. We will see how we get on. Might as well use the last little bit and we'll give the clove some, even though this is growing absolutely ridiculously and definitely doesn't need it, but. There we go, so. First feeding day one of reefroids, 
Um, if you've watched my previous video, then you've seen the uh, initial before. So we're going for some before and afters over a period of time. We will continue to monitor. Um, I'm going to do a few updates on the reefroids and the progress, how we feel that we're getting on, um, changes that I've made in how much I use, ways of feeding, things that I learn as I go along and so on. Um, if you've got any comments, advice, ways of doing it differently or any help that you can give me, then it will be much appreciated. Let me know. Other than that, there we go. The little reef. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment and please subscribe if you know anyone. Uh, share the videos on your Facebook, your Instagram. Help me out. i um, trying to get the page to 1,000 subscribers real fast. So help me out. Thanks for watching.